I do know like he's one of the most famous players of a uh, Montreal Canadian. I know he's like the player who won the most Stanley Cups. Montreal Canadiens legend Henri Richard has died at the age of 84. The Hockey Hall of Famer won a league record 11 Stanley Cups as a player during his 20-year NHL career, all spent with the Habs. The little brother of Maurice Richard, the pocket rocket as he was known, was named captain of the Canadiens in 1971 until his retirement in 1975. Here is number 16 peering into the Stanley Cup after scoring the winning goal to capture another championship with the Habs. Habs on May 18, 1971. Montreal defeated Chicago 3-2 in the seventh game to take the title. Many sharing their memories and condolences online. Premier François Legault tweeted Merci Pocket Rocket and that he's keeping his memories of number 16 close. Mayor Valérie Plante saying that Quebec and the hockey world lost a legend and one of the biggest ambassadors for the Canadians and in Montreal sports history. On the streets of Montreal, fans had this to say. I think that uh, his legacy will be very strong strong in Montreal because he was such an amazing player. It's definitely a big legacy. Uh, I guess it's sad that he goes and I don't think we're going to see another player like that in a, in a very long time, if ever. Henri Richard died overnight Thursday into Friday after a long medical battle. He suffered from Alzheimer's in the last few years of his life. Richard still holds the record for the most games played in a Montreal Canadiens uniform, 1,256. Et c'est Richard Bertin qui se penche vers la zone adverse. Et là, une passe à Bertin. Well, I first saw Henri Richard play in St. John's when the junior Canadians came to Newfoundland on a tour. He was the outstanding player. I remember a penalty killing role he played. Henri killed a penalty himself. He had the puck. Whole two minutes. It, it, uh, the most beautiful skater we have seen, you know, I mean, he, and he was a year away from the big club. In those days, there was not a lot of players as, as his size that made it, but uh, the story is when he, when he went to the training camp in 1955, he elevated his game so much he had the puck that the Canadians said, wow. The first star, Henri Richard. What he brings as a former captain, as a man that represents everything about what the Montreal Canadiens stands for. And uh, he is Henri Richard, I mean, his brother, him, they're a uh, legend. Maurice Richard passed it in front of Henri Richard. And the Richards combined there for a perfect goal. At 19 years old, you come on the team. And uh, that was the first guy I met uh, before my first game in Detroit. He was outside of the hotel. And I look at him and I said, Henry, I'm coming to help you. And I was very young. And he looked at me and said, oh, maybe. <laughs> but we won the game, that game, 7-3. Henry never talked too much. Loved the game. Wanted to stay all the, on the ice all the time. We need to have a lasso to get him out of the ice. He could stay there and skate and skate and skate. He, he never took a night off. He gave it his all. The only thing maybe part of that was when he first arrived, he said, that's the only way I can succeed in the shadow of my brother is I've got to, you know, I can't just coast. And he didn't. The numéro 16, Henri Richard.